Do you feel the pull? Hello, everybody. Uh, good to see everybody again. I just wanted to uh, take a minute. I've been looking uh, for ICOs or uh, even though this isn't an ICO, it's a CDE, coin distribution event. I saw an article on MSNBC about it, and it really intrigued me. So I decided that I would do a video to go over the white paper and also uh, go over this MSNBC article. So without further ado, this was uh, shared by G. Stephanie on MSNBC. So let me go ahead and uh, go over this. It says Apollo cryptocurrency is the world's most feature rich cryptocurrency. That in itself uh, really kind of piqued my interest. So I wanted to look into it a little bit more. So it says the Apollo Foundation has launched the world's first feature rich and all inclusive cryptocurrency called Apollo cryptocurrency. It is backed by a community of expert researchers, marketers, and developers who all aim to create an all-in-one cryptocurrency with all the features so users can enjoy full secrecy from one dashboard. Apollo is undoubtedly the most advanced and feature-rich cryptocurrency. It has several features that are not available together with any other currencies such as decentralized exchange, decentralized marketplace, a complete asset, monetary, and alias system, coin shuffling, advanced encryption, multi-signature accounts, blockchain file storage, and several third-party plugins to choose from. Apollo cryptocurrency supports different wallets, including web, Windows, OS X, Windows Plus, and Linux. These features make it a future currency that anyone and everyone can use. Apollo currency is the only currency that works seamlessly in China. It makes Apollo one of the few cryptocurrencies that work in China. Advanced IP masking is used to pass the Chinese firewall. This is achieved by packaging Tor information as SSL packets, which don't make it usable in China, but the SSL packets ensure 100% privacy. Cryptocurrency is everywhere. Around 5% of millennials have invested in a cryptocurrency. 2.77% of Generation X have purchased cryptocurrency, and 1.58% of baby boomers are into it. Apollo Foundation understands the need of the time of the time and this is why it created its all-in-one cryptocurrency that people can use to replace their existing currencies and switch to a single top tier currency it integrates everything that people at large need in today's currency system and then it says visit www.apollocurrency.com to check all the exciting features and to read the white paper now i will put a link in this video for this, uh, a Facebook, com uh, unofficial Facebook community. Uh, I'll put links to their Telegram. And uh, I also have a, a code where you can get 10% additional. Now, this is a CDE and a coin distribution event. When we get into their, um, into looking at their uh, website, that uh, there's a distinction between an ICO and a CDE. An ICO uses uh, your funds and looks at you as an investor in the project. And, uh, you know, your funds are used to develop and create. And a CDE is a coin distribution event. And that distribution event uh, means that these coins and development have already been processed in large part. So... Um, you can purchase the, the coin and, uh, they will issue it to you, uh, immediately. And so we're not waiting, uh, for different steps to happen. So right now, uh, I believe by the website, they have two, uh, exchanges that they're, uh, have pending listings on and the wallets are created and I'll, we'll go over that a little bit more as 
uh, we go over uh, their website. So without further ado, I do have that website. I'm going to play a couple videos from them. They're really short, like one of them I think is 33 seconds and one of them is a bit longer. So um, we're going to go over that here really quickly. So here we are at the Apollo uh, Currency.com website. Obviously, I mean, I thought it was a good looking website. I'm kind of a sucker for the moving graphics, but it looks really good. So what I'm going to do is scroll down. It says the ultimate currency, and we're going to open this up and actually play this, I believe, 33 second video. Okay. Okay, guys, I came up with a little bit of technical difficulties with the sound, but I think I've got those ironed out right now. So... This is the 33 second video from the Apollo uh, currency.com website. And we're going to uh, play that real quick for you guys. 33 seconds, so bear with me. Might be a little bit loud, so you might want to adjust your speakers. So that was a short little uh, <clears throat> video from their website, right? So let me go back to their website. All right, here we go. And obviously they got a button here to go to the distribution event. Uh, I do have an influencer code that I will put in the description that you can get an extra 10% off if you put that in the uh, influencer code line. So i uh, tell you that right now. Uh, here's some about, uh, Apollo, which a lot of this was in the other video, um, features, uh, a lot of features guys about the, I'm just going to hit the headlines here, Olympus protocol, um, decentralized exchange, decentralized marketplace, next generation blockchain, uh, alias system, cloud storage. Multi-sig phase transactions, voting system, advanced account control, encrypted messaging, monetary system, and asset system. So I wanted to go over to this next generation blockchain. This says, having utilized the NXT technology as our base, we are developing Hermes, uh, you know, the Greek god Hermes, to be its replacement. Hermes will allow the Apollo blockchain to grow faster and healthier the larger the Apollo user base grows, rather than slower with, uh, as with most cryptocurrencies on the market. Whereas our current speed may be 20 to 30 seconds on average, transac transaction times will differ, Hermes will allow for the transaction speeds of two to three seconds. Our goal in integrating Hermes is to become the safest, fastest, and most private cryptocurrency on the market. So... I have sent Apollo coins from my wallet to a friend's wallet, and by the time, I mean, literally, I hit the send button, within a couple seconds, they show up on his wallet. It, it's extremely fast at this point, so that was really exciting to me. Uh, you know, it's a proof-of-stake coin, so the wallets here, which uh, they've got a Linux wallet coming. They do have a web wallet, a Windows wallet, an OS X wallet, uh, OS X plus Tor is coming in Windows plus Tor. So they do have Windows plus Tor available. Right now, uh, they've been confirmed to be to being listed on Nebula and Byte BTC. As far as I know, they're not listed there quite yet, but they have been confirmed to be getting listed there. Uh, right now, there is one day, 21 hours, 33 minutes, and the seconds are counting down to uh, the end of this phase, which the current phase is week four through six. I'm late getting to the party, obviously. And the price is 0 .004 USD. 
So basically, you get two and a half for one penny. <clears throat> Excuse me. Two and a half for one penny. And starting the 14th, they're having the late sale at 0 .005. So it's going to go up a bit uh, starting the 14th. Um, this ends on the 13th. However, it says the mid-sale ends one day, 21 hours, 32 minutes. Okay? So... Right now, I know this says uh, percentage of Apollo distributed, updated frequently, that there is, and this is one thing that people have raised kind of issue uh, with me on the Apollo coin. It On the white paper, which we'll get to, it's showing 30 billion. That's right, 30 billion with a B. However, any tokens or coins that are not sold uh, by the end of the sale will be burned. And from what I gather, the projection is between 15 and 18 billion. That's less than like electronium. Um, so, you know, to me, less coins, um, I'm less coins. And if you could just get to the price of electronium, you have over 2x, right? Actually, two and a half to one cent. Electronium's between two and three cents. So you have done, you know, quite a bit of uh, growing. So that's just my personal opinion. Of course, I have to use the disclaimer everybody uses. I'm not a personal uh, financial advisor. Uh, these are merely my opinions. Uh, but my opinion right now is that I'm liking this. So this is a longer video they have listed on the site that I'm going to go ahead and play. It's about two minutes, but um, let me blow this up so everybody can see The it. rise of cryptocurrency has opened up a way for people to control their funds outside of the traditional banking system. Although there are a variety of currencies to choose from in the current market, users are left using one currency for one application and a different currency for another. For instance, if you need to generate a token or smart contract, but also need a private transaction option, you will need to use one currency to generate the token and another to send private transactions. There is currently no all-in-one currency that combines the most useful features available and utilizes them on a single platform. This is why we created Apollo. Apollo will be the first currency that will allow a 100% private transaction option with IP masking as well as smart contracts, an asset system, currency and token system, encrypted messaging, file sharing, a decentralized marketplace, multi-signature accounts, voting system, alias system, decentralized data storage, decentralized exchange, coin shuffling, and much more. All on a next generation blockchain. What many people do not know is that by using mainstream currencies such as Bitcoin to send transactions, not only are a user's transactions trackable and their balance open for all to see, but their IP address is also vulnerable, allowing anyone to see how much you are sending from your wallet, your total balance, as well as the physical location you were sending the transaction from. Current top privacy coins have sought to fix this issue by removing the ability to send a public transaction, but the user's IP is still traceable and completely removing public transactions annihilates opportunities for mass adoption. Exchanges also still require information to be KYC compliant, so the user never has the ability to purchase privately. Our solution is to integrate a decentralized exchange as well as allowing users the option to send a public or private transaction, all while completely masking their IP address. On top of this, coin shuffling allows their total balance to be masked, making for a truly invisible experience. These integrations, along with the integration of the Hermes blockchain, will make Apollo the most advanced, feature-rich, all-in-one currency available. With regulation swiftly approaching, keep your assets safe on one of the only truly unregulatable currencies. We are here because we believe the only person that should be in charge of your funds is you. And I, too, believe that. So, um, you know, for me right now, <clears throat> this, obviously, uh, you can claim a referral bonus there. You can use Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin. It looks like Bitcoin Cash and Dash. Um, 
their operations team, Victor. Uh, I'm going to call him Victor K is the director uh, because I don't want to. I think Kanavalov, I'm probably slaying that, right? So I, I don't want to slay his name terribly, but uh, right now uh, we'll call him Victor K. So Victor has turned ideas into realities for many companies, starting with Brand Live, which was acquired by Microsoft, uh, Green Battery Limited, and most recently investing in helping grow blockchain projects such as Kuna Exchange, DMarket, Kick ICO, Anize, Hacken, Veda, and Emotic. So uh, DMarket, I don't know much about Kuna Exchange, to be honest with you, but DMarket and Kick ICO, definitely heard of them. Um, so he's got some projects behind him. And, you know, that is uh, really awesome to me. So right now, when you start looking through this portion here, uh, you can see that there's lots of big names dropped uh, for like Alexander Mora. Um, I've spoken to him. Uh, Disney, Verizon, ESPN, Deportes, NASCAR, Sears, XM Radio, General Motors, and Jack Daniels. So he's been with some big companies uh, helping them. Uh, also... Uh, the marketing side, Catherine Manning, uh, IBM, Microsoft, and Red Hat. I mean, she's part of the Apollo team. Uh, I mean, and it goes on and on, guys. There's plenty of uh, big names in here that this team has worked with. And, you know, like anything, everybody's uh, talents have, have, you know, varied. So at any rate, very big team. Uh, they have a fan store where you can get some gear there if you'd like. Uh, roadmap on the webpage. Uh, you know, also go to the white paper here. And we will download that. And I'll even try to zoom it in so you guys can see it a bit better. Uh, these are things that really, um, to me, it's really clean and uh, good looking. It talks about the Olympus protocol, Hermes blockchain, current features, future features, uh, the vision, what is Apollo, coin distribution event, currency allocation, uh, roadmap team, and quick info. So the abstract is pretty much what we've already comp uh, talked about and and looked at with it being uh, Apollo is a new cryptocurrency commissioned to become the most advanced feature rich available. Its main goal is to provide users with an effective all-in-one currency with which they can buy and sell with complete assurance of privacy. So uh, I'm not going to read every detail, guys, because I want you, I want you to go to this website and I want you to go to this white paper and read it for your own. Never take anybody's uh, opinion on where to spend your money because in the end it's your responsibility but with that being said i've gone in deep on this guys so just letting you know i've personally gone in deep on this one i was waiting uh the last one that i got in on was uh universa i pass up a bunch of icos and cds because it just doesn't seem to be that, uh, you know, that good. Uh, Universa I got in on, Electronium I got in on, a couple other little ones, but this to me seems like it has a great shot, especially with the exposure on MSNBC and some other avenues. Um, they've already got fully functioning, uh, they've got fully functioning um, social media, they have uh, tech support. All of that's already in place, guys. It's not developing. Um, and when we get down to there, you know, here's a quick snapshot of the wallet. Uh, it's uh, it's pretty attractive. So it says Apollo offers absolute freedom and total control in an alternative decentralized framework. 
And then it's got a quote from Harvard Business Review quoted, to protect the blockchain vision from political pressure and regulatory interference, blockchain networks rely on, decentral on a decentralized infrastructure that can be controlled by one person or group. This freedom-inspired blockchain is the core vision of Apollo. Unfortunately, as we will lay out in this document, current cryptocurrencies, although mostly decentralized, have many flaws that allow for outside entity to easily control and regulate. Apollo offers a solution indefinitely free from political pressure. <clears throat> so I'm going to go down here and, you know, it, it briefly outlines some of the top cryptocurrencies, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Ripple, uh, and then some top privacy cryptocurrencies like Dash, Monero, and Verge. And, uh, you know, this, hopefully, I might have to shrink it down a little bit so you guys can, whoop, wrong way, sorry guys. So you can see, all right, so again, I want you to go look at this on your own, but it shows the wallets and all of the features that are coming and that are, uh, already here, right? So by the green check, they checked everything except for smart contracts, which is coming soon, and privacy transactions, which is always also coming soon. Compared to the other coins on the market, this one does it all. And uh, I've been playing around with the wallet. It's really kind of cool. Uh, and I'll try to show you a bit of that as we go here. Uh, so this is Apollo Solution utilizing world-class team. The Apollo Foundation is offering the all-in-one currency capable of replacing every other on the market. Solution, Olympus Protocol, Hermes Blockchain, current features, and then future features. So Olympus Protocol has IP masking, public and private transaction options, integrated decentralized exchange, and coin shuffling. So uh, that is pretty cool. Um, and there's a graphic on how it works. If you want to take the time to go and, and watch how this, uh, how this works in this graphic, by all means, do that. Uh, the Hermes blockchain, it's a sustainable blockchain. The Hermes blockchain will make Apollo an incredibly secure, lean cryptocurrency with indefinite stability has lightning fast transactions. Hermes will take a transaction speed that averages 10 to 30 seconds and make the same blockchain facilitate transaction as fast as two to three seconds. Utilizing our newest blockchain technology will help Apollo one of the fastest, be one of the fastest cryptocurrencies on earth. This will help to establish its dominance as it opens up huge potential in microtransactions, decentralized banking, financial services, and more. Now, I said it earlier in the video, this coin is lightning fast from <laughs> swapping from my wallet to my friend's wallet was darn near immediate. I mean, it was like, boom. I actually did a live video covering a lot of this same stuff over on Facebook and I click send to send someone some coins in the audience. He's like, as soon as you hit the send on the video, it was showing in my wallet. So really quick guys. Um, the currency features a monetary system, um, it, which allows, it says the monetary system within Apollo allows users to instantly create currencies or tokens that can be traded privately on Apollo's decentralized exchange, as well as freely on external exchanges. These currencies can easily be backed by Apollo, giving them instant tangible value. So this is possible use for crowdfunding, ICO, finance, charity, voter IDs, escrows, coupons, currency, etc. Uh, system asset or asset system. Using the Apollo asset system, a user can issue tokens representing anything from public and private equity to real world commodities. Unlike other markets and cryptocurrencies, users will be able to trade these assets with 100% with privacy. So uh, encrypted messaging, I've done that. You can send a message through your wallet to your friend's wallet. Uh, there's a slight fee um, in Apollo, but it's totally, um, it's totally encrypted. So... That's a pretty cool feature. Blockchain file storage. The Apollo 
Data Cloud allows uploading to the blockchain for storage, retrieval, and publishing of information. This gives a user the ability to upload a file to the blockchain, therefore receiving an irrefutable timestamp for that data. This timestamp could be helpful in establishing an absolute date for legal documents such as contracts and intellectual ownership. Alias system. Uh, this system in Apollo can be used to create a unique alias that acts as a representation for a specific set of text. This will encrypt the chosen text into the alias. This text could be your account number, a website, email address, etc. Um, so, it, I mean, it's just got tons and tons and tons of features, guys. More than I've seen <laughs> on any other currency. So, uh, we'll go by the coin distribution event down here. It's, it says, as stated, unlike ICOs, Apollo is not simply an ERC-20 token that is printed instantly. Apollo is its own cryptocurrency and many usable features and many new features being developed. This is not an ICO setup with the goal of raising money for a project that has not been started. The Apollo Foundation's goal with this coin distribution event is to distribute Apollo into as many hands as possible as quickly as possible. So, uh, this is a has a breakdown of the currency uh, allocation on here. Uh, Fifty three percent offered to public and first coin distribution. Three percent to advisors. Uh, currency distribution event distributed to Vendors and investors, 6%. Founders team and volunteers, 8%. Distributed to 100,000 wallets via airdrop, 10%. Marked for development, marketing, and future distribution, 20%. So this seems to uh, be pretty good distribution split up. Again, this doesn't have to be paid for development because it's already developed, guys. Um, here's the roadmap. Um, I mean, you can go all the way through here. There's going to be a blockchain upgrade at some point. They don't really at this point uh, have dates assigned, but we know we're right here in coin distribution event. Um, there's going to release the full source code. Uh, iOS wallet, Apollo added to exchanges. We know this is already happening, so we're somewhere in here. Um, they're going to have a wallet upgrade. So a bunch of stuff coming. Olympus protocol release somewhere down here. Uh, again, here's the notable operations team. You can look, same as the web page. Uh, noted developers. Uh, a lot of quick information here, like the wallet. It says total supply, like I said before, is $30 billion. What is not issued by the end of the CDE is going to be destroyed, guys going to be destroyed they're projecting between 15 and 18 billion again that's less than electronium and some of the other currencies out there um so i think that there's a good opportunity here you can buy a lot of apollo uh inexpensively um and hopefully ride it to the moon i mean that's the uh the plan, right? That's what we all want is a moonshot. I think this has as good a shot as any. Um, actually, I think it's got better than uh, most of them. So um, definitely opportunities here for you guys to get involved, get involved with the CDE while it's still uh, 0.04. You still have a day or so left of that, day and a half, and, you know, and get your get your coins guys i mean i've got my wallet here uh actually already staking i don't really want to uh put my wallet information out so i'm not gonna post that up at this time uh but it is uh it it is forging already so there is a little bit of duration once you make a deposit in there you have to wait 1440 confirmations uh and it doesn't automatically stake. You have to uh, actually, they call it forging. You click forge at the top. You put in your mnemonic phrase. 
and click OK. And if you have currency over 1440 blocks uh, depth, then it will begin to forge. So I really like that. I like staking coins. Uh, so that was, uh, that was a pretty nice feature there. Uh, it's more green, you know, no waste of energy, uh, and get you extra currency. So at this point, guys, I appreciate you guys checking us out. I'm working on getting some interviews going with the Apollo team, and hopefully that comes to fruition soon. So without further ado, guys, you guys have a great day and we will talk to you soon.